good evening out there in 2k land man check this out man i think i got some sauce for y'all bro and what i'm saying i think i got some sauce for y'all this is like a1 whatever 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 type type sauce bro um i think i might be on to something i'm gonna figure it out I, 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 the one thing I hate, I can't stand about jump shots in this game. I feel like the reason that we're missing is because when you, the, inst, the actions are not instant, meaning the time that elapses between the time I press the button and an action being created on the screen is 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 incredible. Like I feel like it's almost a half a second, quarter second sometimes. Like like I'm, like, and nothing happened that time. Not to mention when that happens. Look at that. That's that's literally a half a second to a quarter second, bro. So it's like, like you have to wonder if you're going to get in that time. I didn't get nothing. So you got to be like, am I going to get that quarter second slowdown or where nothing happens? And then you're anticipating. And then when something does happen, you have to try to overcompensate and try to hit the shot, man. And I think that that might be what's bothering a lot of us because it's hard to just lay off that. You have a timing in your head, like your bailout timing, and it's just hard to lay off that, lay on the button until you see the cue and, uh, you know, and, and for something to happen because sometimes like we're just antsy and we just want to see it because you might get the super fast when you get the super fast and you can't even react to it. And that's that's what I, I've been trying everything to uh, to mitigate that. It's, it's no, it's, there's no mitigation. It's just not, it's, it's gonna happen. That part is gonna happen. I think I do have a, a, a thing for the herky jerkiness in your jump shot and stuff. Uh, and, and we are gonna talk about all that in one second, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all already in the thing. I wish I rested for all that time and nothing happened. Y'all already know we're trying to go with this thing. To the moon, Alice! And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all my brothers, my sisters, my family. Love each and every last one of y'all. Let's just get this jump shot together for y'all, man. Like I said, I put this jump shot together. My guy, Frog, he came through. He was telling me, yo, I was like, Frog, I keep missing out here because I ain't got no, um, the ball return ain't in here. He's like, bro, you ought to just get some people to come in here and ball return that joint for you. Just run it down and you just catch and shoot and get your stuff to get, get your stuff together for the very next game. And that's what he said. And I was like, you know what? But I ain't Hollywood like that, man. You know, I'm, I'm gonna grind this thing out. But anyway, let y'all know straight up we're on set point. That's that's all, all that. So we, we, we gonna figure this thing out, man. Like I said, I really wish that there was some way to not have that, that what's it called? We're gonna figure that out. But this is a jump shot right here, man. Gordon Hayward is the base. Louis Hachimura is release one, 71%. LeBron James, that's what Frog put me on. I said, is there anything that goes above the head or in front? And he's like, LeBron James. So LeBron James, 29, Louis Hachimura, 71. It's Louis on his Twitter. Don't at me. Let's just get into it. Now, time and stability is a B. I feel like if the time stability goes up any, I really feel like you're not going to be able to, if the time stability goes up any, it'll probably be an 86 jump shot, something like that. So uh, when, when you get up in, 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 when it's all A's, it's tough, man. C release speed, but you got an A defensive immunity and an A release speed with a C, C minus release height. I, I, I wanted to try to, I was trying to find something with James Harden, bro. Bro, James Harden is hard in, because it's like, Cause like James Harden got good numbers, but bro, it's that um, it's bro. This is with, with James Harden, this is what kills you. Uh, like you can't get it above that D plus, so you can get all A's, but I can't get it above that D plus, and I don't even know if I could deal with that. Like, is there something I could deal with? So now I'm gonna try to put something together where that James Harden is 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 more, but it's a D minus, bro. It's almost an F on the uh on the joint but everything else is an a so it's like like is that a good one too i don't know but we're gonna go with gordon hayward for right now because you know you can get all a's with james Harden, but you can get that just as a sneaky tidbit in here but that's not the sneaky tidbit that i wanted to give y'all um and no i have not tried it out with james harden i just tried it out with gordon hayward because i just couldn't get james Harden stats the way i wanted them to be but next next jump shot is gonna be james harden and we're gonna get them stats where we want it to be anyway so what I was saying, when I said, I think I found some sauce, man. This is like, I got, I put everything on. I'm starting to see, I, I, I'm i thinking that you got your motion style, your dribble style, and your triple threat style. Those things I think can kind of impact what you can do. I can't get any dribble styles. 
So that's why I got everything on basic. If I if I could get any other dribble styles, I promise you I would. But I can't get no dribble styles. All I can get is uh is basic. That's it. Like, what's the restrictions? You gotta have 40 speed with ball. So like, I ain't got no speed with ball. Am I gonna get any speed with ball with him? I, I don't think I am. Attributes, uh, yeah, speed with ball is on 25. So that's where I'm gonna be. Um, yeah, it's max. Yeah, 25 max. Uh, so I'm not gonna get any of that. But I, I wonder, what I wanna ask y'all is, have y'all had the same motion dribble and um, have y'all ever had a player with the same motion dribble and triple threat style? And, and does it seem like it's smoother when all three of those are the same versus when they're different? Because I can tell you, I put on like, uh, like I can't get no, no triple threats. Like it, it ain't no triple threats in here. I can get Kobe and I can get LeBron. And, uh, and Joel and B, like I said, I feel like it's one of the best, but I can't get no Steph Curry motion style to make that match. So if we put on Kobe, right, uh, for the motion style and Kobe for the, for the joint, I, I, for my motion style and my triple threat, I, I've, I've had LeBron on, then I had basic, basic, basic. I feel like, man, when they match, it makes it feel a little smoother. Maybe it's not as herky jerky in the jump shot or going to the jump, going into the jump shot. I'm gonna have to lab it with my other player a little more, but I feel like it's like you just, it's a little less herky jerky when you do something. But <clears throat> I've also found that this happens. Your guy stands up, no matter who, what, what you got, dribble style, what? He stands up and he goes down and he stands up and then he'll go back down. And then he's gonna stand up. And then he's going like, what's the reason for that? And and like, if I shoot from the up position, will my shot be faster? So that's it slightly early, right? Now I'm gonna shoot from the down. You always gonna miss the first one, it doesn't matter. All right, so we're gonna shoot from this down position. And it felt like that was, you know what I'm saying? So it feels different regardless. The Kobe, uh, I ain't got a lot of Kobe's motion style and triple threat. They do feel smooth, um, but it's like, like it, it, it looks, it feels faster or whatever, but it's just, it's just weird, man. I don't know. When you change those things, they definitely make a difference, though, because the shot, like, you see, I have to I have to relearn the shot off of that. So be careful if you do this. But I want to know, y'all let me know if y'all relearn, if y'all had to relearn. That, that couple with the fact that I'm hitting the button and nothing is happening, it, 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 it is what it is. But y'all let me know if y'all have done done this. Like, like I said, with that, changing that, it, it feels like it changes everything, right? Like I just had learned basic and now I'm, now we switch to Kobe. It does feel different. It does feel smoother. But let's say if I put Kobe and and uh, Joel Embiid on, will it feel herky jerkier? I, I don't know, but it is what it is, man. I just wanted to ask y'all that, but it definitely feels like everything goes into your shot. Like right now, you see, I just put on the Kobe and I missed what, two out of three or whatever, but I feel like it's nothing I can't get used to. But I was labbing LeBron earlier. And like I said, I can't I can't get the same, I can get the same motion style. Maybe motion style don't have nothing to do with offense at all. I bro, I don't know. But I'm just I'm re, I'm grasping at straws and I just need y'all to help me out on this one. So let me know what the business is if y'all have combined all three and if you feel smoother or whatever. But like I said, I, I got the LeBron James on, I had the LeBron James. And you see LeBron James dribbles. His dribbling is, it, you know, and and they stand up, but it's just like it's a little different. It's not as fast. I feel like like the Kobe was, like he was he would jerk, but then then I have to wait to shoot it. LeBron, because you know maybe it's because it's his part of his jump shot is in here and all that. Maybe it just seems smoother. I I don't know, bro. I'm grasping at straws right now and I need y'all's help. So let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Help your boy out. Do, have you combined motion dribble and motion dribble and triple threat style? And does it feel better than when all of them are different? Because like I tell you, this 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 LeBron feels better. LeBron, LeBron feels better than LeBron and MB. And uh it, it definitely feels better than the Kobe to me. But you know, that's just that's just me. And it could be perceived or placebo effect because that was super fast. But uh, I'm still trash. Anyway, let me get out of here, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I'm gonna holler at y'all next time. Till next time. Please let me know if y'all have combined 
the same dribble uh motion and triple threat style and does it doesn't even matter this motion even matter on i feel like it matters but it might not but i'm gonna tell next time till next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's town Gosh, baby. Gosh.